Now let's take a look back at the week that was in Oberlin College Athletics. The record-setting seasons for the Oberlin College basketball teams came to an end in the NCAC quarterfinals as the Yeomen fell to top seed at Ohio Wesleyan 83-66. Big man Randy Ollie did his part with 20 points on 6 of 9 shooting, while senior Austin Little added 15 points off the bench in his final game. The Oberlin women hosted their first tournament game since 1990, and the crowd was there in support of the historic occasion. Back-to-back three-pointers from Lindsey Bernhardt early in the second half tied the game at 39, but the fifth-seeded Bishops of Ohio Wesleyan pulled away for a 75-58 win. Playing in her final game, NCAC Player of the Year, Christina Marquette scored 22 points and ripped down seven rebounds as she departs as the school's all-time leading scorer and rebounder. In its lone match of the week, the men's tennis team picked up a 7-2 win over Indiana Tech. Junior Kalen Lewis was named the NCAC Player of the Week for his efforts as he was a winner at number one doubles and number three singles. The women's tennis team easily handled Division II Ashland by an 8-1 count, but then dropped a 5-4 decision on the road at the University of Northwestern Ohio. Senior Grace Porter was a double winner against the Racers, earning victories in the top flights in both singles and doubles. The track and field teams had their final toot up before this weekend's NCAC championship meet. First year's Annie Goodridge and Lila Draft Johnson impressed, earning wins in the triple jump and 400 meter dash, respectively. The Yeoman lacrosse team opened its season in grand fashion, knocking off the Olivet Comets 16 to 8. Eleven different Yeomen scored a goal in the game, led by Nick Lobley's five-goal performance. That's your update. Go Yeoman!